Hello everyone, I am Sonali Nabo, Assistant Professor of Computer Engineering Department of All India Sri Shivaji Memorial Society, Institute of Information Technology, Pune. Today, our topic is uh, Next Application Layer Protocol, that is MIME and COG. MIME, uh, MIME is nothing but the multi-purpose internet mail extension. It is the application layer protocol. It is an extension of the original simple mail transfer protocol, that is SMTP, email protocol. And it lets user exchange different kinds of data files, including audio, video, images, and application programs over email. MIME, uh, unlike uh, SMTP, MIME supports sending both ASCII text and non-ASCII data via emails. Uh, for uh, for text uh, in character set other than ASCII, the MIME protocol is required. Uh, then uh, how uh, how MIME works? That is the following figure uh, shows the how MIME works. Uh, in that figure, email with MIME formatting may be transmitted via uh, standard protocols like uh, SMTP, Post Office Protocol, uh, that is POP, or Internet Message Access Protocol, that is IMAP uh, Protocol. The, the body of such message uh, may consist of uh, multiple parts. The header may be uh, specified in non ASCII characters, set MIME supports. And uh, server, uh, server uh, insert the MIME header at the beginning of an Email transmission. Clients use the MIME header to select an appropriate player application for uh, for the data type uh, indicated by the header. And uh, some players are built into the uh, web client or browser. For instance, uh, all browsers come with GIF and JPEG images player and can handle HTML file. Uh, other player uh, may need to be downloaded. Then MIME transforms, uh, transforms uh, non ASCII data uh, to 7 bit network virtual terminal NVT uh, data. And uh, 7 bit uh, ASCII can uh, represent 128 characters. MIME uh, then delivers this transformed data to the client SMTP. Uh, at the recipient end, uh, the message is uh, transferred back to the original data allowing them to see uh, its content. Uh, then uh, it contains uh, text, audio, video, uh, or some uh, other kind of data. Then uh, uh, next is the uh, advantages of MIME. Uh, MIME um, has several advantages over SMTP. Uh, user can uh, send different kinds of binary attachments via email. Then uh, there are no limits uh, on message length. Then uh, multiple attachments on different types of uh, type can be included in the same email. Also, uh, multi uh, multi part messages are supported. The next is the function of M uh, MIME. Um, uh, they, uh, that is the first one is the uh, sign data. Uh, sign data, this consists of uh, message and uh, encrypted with the uh, private key and both the contents has a uh, digital uh, signature encoded with the base 64 and then next is the clear sign data. Uh, in this advantage, uh, it is very similar to uh, sign data, but uh, you will get the difference uh, where, it, uh, where it is clearly mentioned that uh, it has used uh, the encoding base uh, on uh, 64. Then uh, next advantage is the envelope data. Now this encrypts the content where the key will get used and the receiver will get the public key. Uh, then uh, next is the uh, sign and, uh, uh, and uh, envelope data. Uh, this is an combination uh, of both sign and uh, envelope data. And it has the capacity to enclose the digital, sorry, uh, enclose the uh, sign data. And uh, next is the uh, sign uh, receipts. Uh, in that, uh, it is an acknowledgement of the original message. Or you can say that uh, it is a proof of uh, your delivery. 
where it will uh, definitely uh, reach to the sender. Then uh, security levels. Uh, yeah, in the in that um, it gets added uh, with the message to identify the control access and the priority which will increase the confidence level. And next one, uh, last one is the uh, secure mailing uh, list. In that, uh, it will take over the processing uh, where uh, where per recipient will be available and uh, while sending a message to multiple users. Then uh, next application layer protocol is uh, nothing but the post office protocol that is POP. Uh, post office protocol is the uh, most commonly used message request protocol uh, in the internet and world uh, world for transferring messages from an email. Uh, POP is an application layer protocol and uh, in, in the OSI model, model uh, that provides the uh, user uh, end users the ability to fetch the uh, and receive the mail. Uh, then uh, how uh, how POP is work? Uh, following figure shows the how POP, uh, POP that is the uh, post office protocol work. Uh, in that uh, POP work by uh, contacting your uh, email services and downloading all uh, of your new messages from it. And uh, once uh, they are downloaded up to your PC or Mac, uh, they are uh, deleted from the email services. This means that after the email is downloaded, it can only be accessed using the same computer. If you try to access your email from a different device, the message that have been uh, previously downloaded won't be available to you. Thank you.